fight fans, there remains an elephant in the room. While one can only speculate, there is a strong feeling that Fandora cannot legitimately call himself a champion. While he did fight a safe fight and capitalize on the advantage that Zhu's blindness gave, there is much argument that the fight should have been stopped. What's more, Zhu was clearly the stronger fighter before receiving the cut. Even with the cut, the fight went to a split decision. If Zhu can get this result with one eye, imagine what he could do with two. Welcome fight fans to another electrifying episode of Red Impact Boxing. Today we're diving into the heart-pounding action of the Zoo vs. Fandora fight. But before we get into the ring, make sure to hit the like button and smash subscribe to join our knockout community. Now, let's talk about what went down in the rain. But first, a huge shout out to our sponsor, Big Off Road, your go-to source for all things 4x4. Whether you're hitting the trails or conquering rugged terrain, Big Off Road has you covered. Check out the link in the description for some unbeatable deals on 4x4 products. If you're gonna do it, do it on all fours. Get ready for a pulse-bounding journey. This fight took us on a wild ride from the opening bell to the final round. Zhu and Fandora entered the ring with unwavering focus and an unbreakable spirit. From the outset, Fandora was busy throwing jabs with his massive 80-inch reach, but it was Zhu who was distinctively on top as he parried the jab, getting in quick to counter with power punches. These blows were rocking Fandora, snapping his head back. Zhu was looking to be dominant and was a clear favorite for the first two rounds. Late in the second round, Soul Taker went in for a clinch. Head down, he was caught by an accidental elbow, suffering a cash to his head. A fountain of red impaired Zhu's vision for the remainder of the battle. From this point on, Fandora fought a safe fight, keeping the visually impaired Zhu at range. Zhu with his accuracy off, the warrior fought on instinct, but was unable to capitalize. In the end, while it was a brave effort by Zhu, the judges crowned a new champion in the towering inferno. Fight fans, there remains an elephant in the room. While one can only speculate, there is a strong feeling that Fandora cannot legitimately call himself a champion. While he did fight a safe fight and capitalize on the advantage that Zhu's blindness gave, there is much argument that the fight should have been stopped. What's more, Zhu was clearly the stronger fighter before receiving the cut. Even with the cut, the fight went to a split decision. If Zhu can get this result with one eye, imagine what he could do with two. Okay, let's cut to the chase. Amazon Prime's first pay-per-view didn't exactly rake in the dough, but let's not ignore the main event. It was one heck of a showdown, and Shakur's got a point. Zhu deserves a shot at redemption. He took that loss like a champ, and now he's itching for revenge. Let's be real Fandora, facing a fully charged Zhu. You'd be an over your head. The best should fight the best. And there remains a question mark. We don't think you have proven you are the better man yet. So here's the deal. You might be a nice guy. But if you've got the guts to back up that championship talk, accept the challenge. Take the rematch and let's settle this score once and for all. The ball's in your court. Are you ready to step up? Be a man of your word with the rematch. There is plenty of money in a second fight, especially if it goes to Australia. Thanks for watching, boxing fans. Remember to click on the Vic Offroad link in the description for great deals on camping and 4x4. Like, subscribe, and comment to our channel for more great boxing content. Cheers.